So I have here a new lighting system from Viltrox. This is the Ninja 10B. And you pair it with a nice soft box and you can make your photos and videos look a lot more balanced. Mr. Black. By the way, welcome to the channel. My name is Danny Black. I love to share with you cool gear that comes my way. If you're new here, you like this kind of stuff, don't be a stranger. Click that button right there. I'll put links to everything down in the description, plus a coupon code to save some money for a light like this and a surprise link. And if you are in the market for a new studio light or a more professional light to take with you on shoots, you should definitely check out this light right here. This is the Ninja 10B from Viltrox. It's a 120 watt handheld COB LED light and it comes in this nice protective case so you are ready to go on your shoots. You get the power adapter, a lampshade, securing clip, and of course the Ninja 10B with protective cover. You can also get an external battery pack and handle grip if you need more of a run and gun light setup. So looking at the light, it's really designed nicely. It's a nice CRI light and it gives you single and bi-color temperature control. So you can go from a cold light all the way to a warm light and anywhere in between. It has a built-in cooling fan and it's made from aluminum alloy to dissipate the heat properly. And the fan is real quiet, so you don't have to worry about it getting into your audio. It has an L-shaped bracket with 330 degree rotation and it's really strong. The light itself can be controlled from the back dot matrix display and the buttons. You can do all of your adjustments there or through the mobile app, which is really easy to set up, or you can get the remote control and use the remote control with it. And with the remote and the app, you can set up different channels and groups. That way you can change multiple lights at the exact same time. It's the perfect fill light with 120 watt high power, stepless dimming and 10 lighting effects like lightning, TV, candle, bonfire, strobe light, paparazzi, welding, and many more. So for example, if you were shooting a scene where it required to light up people watching TV, where well you could set it on this TV mode and you could see it kind of flicker and it almost looks like I'm just changing channels. And having scene effects like that just makes it so much better to be more creative. Now obviously in a shoot like this, I wouldn't have the light right here in my face. I'd actually have it back behind the camera, maybe up a little bit higher, but I wanted to be able to use this as an example in the shot and that's the only way that I could do that. But if I was to move it back and out of the frame, this is how it would look. And that gives a lot more balance in the lighting and you can see me a lot better. Like for example, turn it off. This is what it looks like with it off. And let's just turn it on, yeah. So that does a really good job. Now, one thing I love about this light versus some of the other lights is that it has a built-in bow and bayonet. So you can put your softbox directly on there compared to other ones where you have to actually use an adapter, which kind of makes it just one extra step that you have to do that's kind of annoying. And by the way, WeLight has a lot of amazing softboxes that you can choose from on their website. And for me, I'm actually looking into getting their VP60 and their VP80. Both of those look really good and I feel like they will light the studio properly. For now, I'm using this third party one, which is actually pretty big. This is about 90 centimeters. A little bit too big for this space, but perfect when you go out and you do shoots, especially at nighttime. Also, I highly recommend getting a stand like this, this one from Newer. This thing's fantastic. It goes up really high, but also I like that there's a hook down here so you can put a sandbag or you can hook your backpack to it just to give it that extra stability so you don't have to worry about it falling over. So this is a really awesome fill light. It's just gonna add so much more balance, but it looks really professional and it comes in at a really good price. And you can mix and match your setup and get different softbox with with it or your hand grips and batteries and things like that. So check it out and just see what works best for you. And you can save some extra money using my coupon code, so make sure you check that out. And Viltrox does make really great products, not just because they look cool and they do the job, but it adds a lot of value to your production. So I think if you're someone that's trying to up your production quality and you wanna get some good studio lights with soft boxes, definitely check out Viltrox. But that's it for me. I, really, I love this light setup. It's just, just ridiculous being so big right here in my face, but it looks amazing and thank you so much for watching. I have a lot of really cool products to share with you coming right out, so do stay tuned to the channel, and I'll see you next time.